welcome to Minimalist. Uh, it's a CTM map by Caledon, where every dungeon is 24 by 24 by 24. So, pretty interesting uh, layout of this map. Reset button. Sometimes so, so many mobs will spawn that you just can't win. Push to warp all players here to clear all mobs. Warp all players here and clear all mobs. Um, yeah, I think I'll have to do that after reading all this stuff because it's probably like spawners down there. I can hear zombies already. Uh, rules and objectives. Um, thanks to all my testers. After some cake. Okay. I'm just gonna go ahead and quickly rewind. Maybe one place wall from Dungeon Hell Nine Man. Maybe gonna have to iron emerald. Ooh, so this this an emerald block. Good to know. Easy difficulty or higher. It's on normal. Um, do not make a move to inner chest. Do not make your own nether portal. One will be provided. There is no real six. Why? <laughs> Don't leave the bedrock enclosure. Do whatever else you need to win. Break blocks, make grinders, anything. Have fun and, ha and die repeatedly. Do I have to die repeatedly? Is that... Do I have to? <laughs> Let's go ahead and read. And your thanks. You're all awesome. Alpha testers. These people. Close beta testers. Fang ride. Ooh. And thanks to all the, the, the sketch and all these people. I, I totally know. <laughs> I recognize some of those names from CTM community thread. Uh, let's go ahead and put the cake down, and uh, oh, there's always a chest under spawn with junk in it, because nobody wants lapis. Okay, so, um, am I all set? Can I uh, push the reset button or try to uh, see if that helps? Reset. There we go. All mobs have been cleared. You are welcome, and poison bit of fine. Fantastic. Yay, take an inventory. Okay, so... Do I see any wood in this room or anything I can use? Not really. Okay, so let's move on. Dum dum dum. Chest. Uh. Hmm. Ah. There. That would be the mob that was making all that noise. Uh. Yep. Sword, torches, food. That's what be expected. Let's take all three swords because I'm totally not gonna die, right? I don't need any backup stuff. Dirt bag. Yeah. Custom mobs. Ooh. Drop some blocks for me. Sweet. Hey, so we saw him spawn like right there. Ooh. There's a spawner. Oop. Anyone behind me? Apparently not. Good. So there must be another spawner somewhere around here. Air! Oop. Yeah. <laughs> They're coming from more than one place. There must be two Oop. spawners, at least. Okay. This would be the spawners that were spawning right underneath me. Kinda pesky you'd put spawners like right underneath where the spawn is that right when the player is trying to read all the rules and stuff, has to deal with all these mobs. Oh well. Ooh, full leather. Wow, this is pretty generous. Okay. Lots of torches. Guess that he hasn't really given me any coal, so these torches are kind of precious. Might as well take the spare set. Because why not? And I should probably remember to actually take up the chests. <laughs> not be a complete derp and leave all my chests everywhere. Okay. I only don't, I don't need one, right? Yeah, zombie flesh. Might as well take the zombie flesh. Might need it. Take some blocks. Got eight dirt blocks. Alright, no wood yet, don't think. Ooh, pickaxe. Ooh, there we go. I can mine some cobblestone for some reason. Why would I mine some cobblestone, though? Hmm. I mean, there is blocks, and eventually I'll make a stone pick, but for now, I don't have any sticks. So, yeah, well, let's head up. I think that was it for this dungeon thingy. Can I uh, move on to something else? Like that looks like something. I don't need to eat yet, so no need for the uh, cake. Am I ever going to eat that cake? Who knows? It's going to be just like my birthday cake. <laughs> Who eats birthday cake? Tr tre trepidatious trees. Okay, trepidatious trees. Ooh, wood. Yay, I can make a stone pickaxe and all, all the stone stuff. And crafting table, which is always <laughs> nice. It's, it's always nice to get a crafting table. Yay, achievements. Um, let's see. Let's go ahead. And... Ooh, bedrock. <laughs> Hard to hit the boundary, fantastic. Yeah, these dungeons are pretty dang small, 24 by 24 by 24, so it's interesting to see what he does with such a small, like, uh, dungeon size and stuff. But, uh, yeah. Let's see. <laughs> and if you look, like, outside the bedrock walls, it's just a bunch of uh, rectangle, or, you know, just a bunch of giant boxes of bedrock connected by thingies. I, I went out there to record the intro, and I didn't really do much else, just to... Uh, fly around, find, found aesthetically pleasing bits, and eh, recorded them for the intro. That's what I do for like every intro I do. Try to make it as spoiler-free as possible, but it's kind of hard to, because, <laughs> you know, bleh. 
Yeah, I should probably also mention that yesterday was like the first day in over two years that I didn't upload something for the day. And, uh, I mean, I don't really care that much, but, um, I'm like, anyone cared that much, I don't, maybe, I don't know. I, I doubt there's that active subscribers on my channel, but, um, yeah, uh, I was live streaming for my RuneScape thing, and, uh, I, I just didn't bother, or couldn't find time to record Minecraft afterward. I thought I would be able to, but, um, unfortunately it got pretty late. Yeah, <laughs> just couldn't. Well, I could have probably, but I just didn't. Oh yeah, I, was, I took a nap, or I tried to take a nap, and then all of a sudden I was asleep for the rest of the day. I hear spiders. Are they behind this wall? Or is this a wall? I should make an axe or a hatchet. That is something I should probably do. Okay. Got plenty of stone. Head back to the crafting table. And do herp derp. Alright. Hatchet. It's usually something I never make, but uh, in this case, I hear spiders. Spiders. Ooh, chest. Ooh, not bad. I'll take that, put that there. Spider eye, might as well take it. Because food. Alright, glowstone, that helps a bit. Uh, Okay, where is this spawner? I don't think... Are there any natural spawns in this map? It wouldn't... Because of the weird layout and how honeypots usually work, um, I would assume that there's, like, no natural spawns. Okay. Didn't see any science about it, though. Oop. Okay. Who is that? What is that? Intersection 1. Huh. Nice. Is there a wall in here, or is it just the path to the intersection? There's a lot more to explore, I think. So I might want to head back a bit and see if there's anything else. Some water coming from the ceiling. I might want to grab that if I get a bucket anytime soon. Ooh. Okay. One thing I have to really be careful of in this map is um, you're basically always going to be in range of the spawners. So you really want to get to them pretty quick. And, and uh, yeah, be able to take on mobs around a corner that are pretty swarmy. So, yeah. Corner work is going to be a big part of this map, I think. I've done pretty well with corners in the past, right? I can I can do stuff. Yeah. Yeah, yeah. yeah, this is about as big as a room gets in this map. So spawners are almost always in range. Alright. Yeah. Food. Okay. Don't know why I said food. I didn't even open the chest yet. <laughs> Felt weird to be able to call what was in that chest and Well, let's kill all these spiders, find find all the rest of these spawners. Assuming there's more. Hey, switch to stone sword, silly. I am not using my Bane of Arthur Rod sword, am I? <laughs> have not thought to change that. <laughs> Inventory slot. Alright. Where's that skelly spawner? These guys sh shouldn't have been natural spawns, so where did they come from? I don't see any more. Hmm, oh, there they are. <laughs> Should probably have fancy graphics on, because this isn't going to be a very laggy map, is it? <laughs> Alright, so, fancy graphics. There we go. Yeah, so now I can see the spawners. Okay. There we go. Spawn it down, although I probably could have farmed it. Yeah, whatever. I'm sure there'll be more skelly spawners. I'm hearing more spiders somewhere, though, so it's kind of be... Mm, ooh, cave spider. Hello? Owie. Meh. Cave spider. Where do you come from? Uh, can I see the spawner now that I have fancy graphics on? Don't think so. Alright, it's... Oop, there you are. Or there's one of them. But where was that cave spider? Where did that cave spider come from? Should probably go around this way. See if there's anything. Just the spawner? I hear more spiders. They sound like they're probably coming from above. But, uh... Did all that chest stuff? Yeah. Okay. Hmm. Yeah, whatever. <laughs> I think I, I looked all the places I could find in that dungeon. And, uh... Yeah, should be good to go for the next area, right? Unless there was a wool in that area I completely missed. But it didn't look like there was anything else to go for, so... Bucket! Oh, the crap, that's pretty generous. Let's combine these bows, because why not? There we go. Um... Did I get any, any drops from the zombies? No carrots or potatoes? Weak. Ooh, eggs for farming, probably chickens. But, uh... Meh. Don't really like chickens. Their food isn't that great, and it's like, meh. Alright, there we go. Yeah. Oh, should I not take out that water? It's going to update. <laughs> mm, let's find easier up uh, water. Well, there's, there's some farming stuff. Oh, potatoes right there, huh? Generous, generous, generous. Okay. Let's go ahead and 
bone meal up a storm and uh, have a good living of food. Okay. Quite the nice little guy making me this farm and whatnot. Okay. This, this piece of grass bugging me. Get out of here. Alright, seven potatoes. I should probably. Do I have enough cobble? No, I need a bit more cobble to make a furnace so I can cook these things. And I'll have to use some wood for it too, so. Alright. I think it's a pretty good shortcut to have this. Although, how was I supposed to find this path? Was it. Was there a path like down here and looped up around somewhere? Maybe? Oh yeah, there's a staircase. Where'd this lead? Oh, was this at the beginning? Okay, so that's how I was supposed to go, but found the shortcut because it sounds... Okay. Yeah, I assume that's going to happen a lot. <laughs> uh, this playthrough is just a bunch of like little shortcuts you can do by just mining a bit out of the wall. Might be a bit cheeky, but it's there. Hot topic. Burn, 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 burn down. Hot topic. Burn it down. Don't let us steal your soul away. Shout out to South Park. Um... Ender chest. Is there anything for single player? No. It's always nice to have like a cookie in there for single players. Uh, single players. Not, no, I mean for single player, not single players. That's just depressing. Um, okay, let's cook these up. Some of the oak planks. I think it's more efficient than oak wood. Okay. Um, magenta wool, so that's not next. Oh, so yeah, I can see the wools. Uh, orange wool. So I assume this is white wool. Ooh. Yeah, you can barely see that white wool. Alright, so go that way that way first. But until then, nom nom nom. Okay, so I'm gonna try to keep these episodes short as like I've been doing uh, since near the middle of the Chimerian Memories map. Uh, I, I went from like averaging about 25 minutes to averaging about eight, eight, 17 to 18 minutes for, per episode. I think that'll work even better for this map because it's a minimalist map, right? So shouldn't have a lot to do per episode, right? Um, or I shouldn't have to do a lot per episode. Like, these dungeons will probably be pretty quick. So the episodes should move along pretty nicely. And it'll be all fun. Yay! And it's a lot easier on me, because if, if I want to do more live streaming of RuneScape over the summer, I gotta <laughs> get these episodes out quicker, I think. So, yeah. Let's see. Ooh, skylight. Can I actually, like, get up there? Or are there barrier blocks? I'd assume he'd put barrier blocks up there, but... <laughs> who knows? Maybe he's just, uh... Counting on that rule of no, don't go up there. Bad. But who knows? All right. Okay. White wool. But do I have anything I really want to store? I guess I'll be back here eventually. So it's like, might as well put some, put a chest down, put in some like stuff I might want later, but not right now. Uh, is this leather gonna last? Probably not. So I'll pr probably just keep that spare set in there. Okay. Eh. Store some wood if I die. It's easy to have. Easier to have. Some wood in the chest, and a sword, but I'm too lazy to put the sword away. Alright. Oop, here we are. Ooh, ladder. <laughs> Is that ladder really necessary? Alright. So there's a spawner. Yeah, good thing I turned fancy graphics on. Um, might have helped to have like a disclaimer at the start of the map, like, Oop, you should probably have fancy graphics on, because, you know, I hide spawners in leaves. <laughs> Not a lot of people do that, usually. Well, maybe some, I don't know. Well, it yeah, depends on the map, I guess. Difficulty and what, they, what they're going for. Ooh. Hello? It's a cave. The skelly. Alright. Torches will be pretty nice for this map since it's in such cramped environments, I think. Um, lighting up spawners will be easier than mining them or finding them. Ooh. Yeah, there's a creeper spawner around here then. Eh, yeah, it's not good. Yeah, I'm fine. Didn't blow up the chest. Alright. Okay. Ooh. Revealed a bit more of the cave, I think. Cute. Yeah, creepers are going to be, like, so revelatory sometimes. <laughs> like, boom, there goes a shortcut. All right. Yeah, I might screw up something important, though, sometimes. <laughs> it's hard to get away from it in such a cramped place. Oop, three of them. Um, let's do something cheeky like that. Let you blow, e blow each other up without blowing the up the environment. Did they blow up the, the environment? I think they did. One of them might have been jumping out of the water. Oop. Yeah, see, that would have been hidden in fancy graphics. Or not fancy graphics. <laughs> how, is, how is someone on fast graphics supposed to find that chest? No. Well, glad I changed it really quickly. Ooh, blocks. Lots of blocks. That's nice. Um, put away. Do I want gunpowder? Let's take it. I might as well. 
Inventory is not the most cramped in the world, so I might as well take these. Okay. And this goes down. Okay. Is there a ladder or anything for me? No. At least I got the blocks now. Light. And kill. Eh. Light then kill. Because spawners. Da -da 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 -da. Not too much challenge yet, but I assume the, uh, <laughs> the the first bits in the map are supposed to be easy, right? Eh. Alright. Where are we? Oop. Is that fleecy box? Is it chest? White wool? Ah, sweet. Wow, that was pretty quick. Got the white wool, first episode, nice. And, uh, yeah, let's head out of here. Should I mine up those spawners for some XP? I don't really need XP right now, but who knows? Yeah, why not? Just give me that XP. Gimme, give gimme, give gimme. Give me. He's been generous with a lot of stuff so far, so it might give me, like, a, like some kind of, I don't know, enchanting device early on. Because... He's been generous with all the other supplies and whatnot, so... Who knows? Okay, did I loot this chest? No, I didn't. Sweet. Chain chest plate. I'll take it. Along with the golden apple. Oop. Herp, herp. And, uh, yeah. Let's pick up these blocks that the creeper blew up. Not bothering to, uh, find out the, where the creeper spawners are, because I'm lazy. And, uh, let's get out of here. So, yeah. This is a cute little dungeon within the confines of the block limit. There's 24 by 24, and a uh, little house at the top. Let's see what that is. That spruce door, 1.8. Bed, I think I'll, yeah, I'll take this bed. Um, because I haven't set my spawn yet, have I? <laughs> Should probably do that. Um, on the off chance I get killed by something. Also, with such small dungeons, fall damage is probably not going to be an issue that much. Hopefully. I mean, oop, oop, oop. Oh boy. Yeah. Yeah. That's Scully shooting at me. Come down there. Ah. Sword ran out. Okay, let's run back down. Ah! Into the cave. Alright. That was a bit derpy. Um, but I should be fine. Eat up. Some sword. Die die. Lol. I'm in the corner so they have derpy mechanic on that. Sometimes the arrow just doesn't hit you. Like I was standing right there and the arrows just went right through my face. And no problem. Alright. Hmm, probably spawning over from standing like right here, so try moving down a bit. Shouldn't really have to light this up because no natural spawns. And uh, just regen a bit. So there's a, definitely a creeper and a skeleton spawner somewhere up there. I killed most of them, so hopefully I can go up here and find spawners. Or at least light them. Eh, skellies though. Hate skellies so much. Emerald! Hello? I'm guessing then that the emeralds are scattered throughout the map. Don't blow up. Oh, that's ah, fine. Uh, owie, owie, owie. Oop. <laughs> that block caught the arrow. Um, oop. Nope. Oh, come on. Lol. <laughs> I think that just saved my life. <laughs> this is my, this is the arrow that would have killed me. Get a good 3D shot of that. <laughs> hey. Alright, well, I guess since he was really close up, he w it wouldn't, probably would have only done a half a heart. So, yeah, whatever. Survivalist. Efficiency 2, axe, might as well replace my stone axe. Some steak, I guess I want. So yeah. Yay, I'm alive though. Alright, creeper house, that's where your spawner is, somewhere around here. And where is it? Where's your spawner, creeper? Eh. Where, where? It's gotta be around here somewhere. There, he's dead. A lot more creepers down here too. Hmm. Okay. Hmm knock you guys off, do some bit of fall damage. Oop. Oop. Not gonna reveal the spawner? No. Yeah, fooey. Well, I shouldn't bother too much more with this area, I don't think. I'll just head back to... Wait, where does that lead to? Hmm. What is this? Fueled fissures? Is this where I get my coal? Huh. It's got no wool on it, I don't think, so... Yeah, it looks like just like a coal mine. There's a blaze spawner, okay. Don't really need any more torches right now, so I don't think I would bother with the coal mine. Might want to pick up a couple for, like, cooking or something. Or furnace work. But, uh, yeah. I think that's about all I should do this episode. Don't really need seeds. And I'll probably come back next time for, uh, the orange wool. Okay. Not too bothered about the coal mine yet, so... I'll come back to that if I need coal. I didn't see any wool on that chest, and maybe that leads to the next intersection. Who knows? But uh, for now, I don't think I need to go in there. So 
Let's block this off from creepers or any other nasties. And uh, yeah, call it an episode. Yeah, thanks for watching. And see you next time for the orange wool capricious caves. Cap capricious caves. Yay! Hey!